icon shutters of the world. In this tutorial, I want to show you a lovely stitch to work scarf. So from my point of view, this is just perfect stitch for a scarf, a cowl, uh, tubular scarves and so on, neck warmers maybe. So this is the stitch, it's a 3D stitch, as you can see it's actually double kind of, but it's also nice and lacy, okay? Now with a similar stitch I already have done a uh, two projects actually. Let me show you the first one, maybe you remember it. It's the pineapple beret that I made from a beret that my grandma had. And uh, I just wanted to make something similar. If you remember, if you don't, don't worry, because I put the link into the eye on the right side of the screen, right side corner. And then I made a, uh, a neck warmer too. And this stitch, I said, it's similar. It's not exactly the same thing, but as you can see, just a little bit, watch them, they are similar. This is more lacy, this is more uh, textured. Now, uh, let us see how to work. So, it is a multiple of 4 plus 3. You can work it with any kind of yarn uh, and hook. This is 1, 2, 3, 4. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. So let's, let's say that, uh, that for me, for the swatch that I want to show you, it's just perfect. So I will uh, chain three more. So it's multiple of four plus three. Now, this is what we have. Now we will chain one more just to begin into the second chain from the hook yarn over insert hook and work your very first double crochet. Now into the second chain work a shell of four double crochets. One, two, three and four. Okay. Chain three. And now uh, this is the sequence to repeat one, two, three and into the four. So we will skip three into the fourth chain. We just want to uh, work three, four double crochets. So the shell of four now chain three again, uh, skip three and into the next work the shell of four double crochets. Two, three. One, two, three, the chain of three, and now again, one, two, three, into the fourth. Let's get, let's have another shell. Three, four, chain three, and when we, uh, one, two, three, we skip three, and we have, we will work the last shell into the second to last stitch, uh, chain stitch. So into the second to last we will work the last chain. Sorry. Uh, into the second to last chain we will work the last shell. Uh, okay. So this is my shell. Now we won't chain three after the last shell worked, but into the last chain we will work a double crochet. So we have the border double crochet at the beginning and at the end. Second row, it's the row, the only row to repeat for the length that we need. So it's really easy. Chain one, yarn over, insert hook into the double crochet and double crochet into it. Now we have the shell of four. We will just yarn over we will work around this fourth double crochet, but we just want to push like this and to pinch it, pinch from the back side. Insert hook and work one, two, three, four. And this is my shell. Chain three 
and let's see, yarn over, this is my fourth double, fourth double crochet, so just push it a little bit just to know where it is and pinch it with your fingers, like this. And work one, two, three, and four double crochets. So that's it, one, two, three, let me show you one more time. It's here, my, let's pinch it on the back side, okay? Insert hook, like this, and work one, two, three, and four. Chain three, and we have two more. This is the second to last, this is the stitch, like this. I have it here. So yarn over, insert hook like this around the stitch and work one, two, three, four. Again chain three and we have the last shell. Here it is the last the fourth stitch of the shell. Don't forget that we have the double crochet, the border double crochet. This is the shell, one, two, three, four, and this is the fourth, so it's actually the second to last. Push like this and pinch like this. Oops, yarn over once only for the double crochet and one, two, three, and four. Now, we don't want to forget to work our double crochet into the double crochet, which is here. Okay, work your, work your double crochet. Okay, now again, I will show you one more time, but this is it. Chain one, double crochet into the double crochet, and let us begin with the shells. So we have one, two, three, four, this is the fourth, push like this and pinch and work one and two and three you can fold the work so we can work better and four chain three again this is the next this is it this is the double crochet so pinch it like this and work your four oops I forgot to yarn over work your four double crochets one two three and four chain three this is the next push and pinch and work your shell of four. One, two. This is the mm, the way we work the shell, or where we work the shell, gives uh, us this mm, really lovely shape, 3D shape. Chain three. Yarn over. We have it here. Mm, let's go on and work one. two, three, and four. Chain three. This is the last, this is the double crochet where I want to work. And one, two, three, and four. Don't, so don't chain three after the last shell and before the first shell. And double crochet for the border double crochet. So this is it. This is what we have. Look at it. So interesting stitch. Really nice. Now uh, I made this uh, last row. So when you finish the length you will put this row, so as you can see, if you don't put that row, 
uh, the work come comes to something like this so it's very open it's not it doesn't have a nice shape at the end so we want to give it a nice shape so for this we will just uh, chain one turn into the double crochet single crochet then chain three and again push the double crochet the fourth and around it work only a single crochet okay one two three and exactly the same thing here it is around it we work only a single crochet one two three just just go on like this single crochet one two three crochet and now uh, into this only into this last uh, row we chain three bet in between the double crochet first double crochet and the shell let's say but we work only a single crochet and we will chain three after the last shell after we worked on the last shell the single crochet we will chain three and on the top of the last double crochet we single crochet and as you can see this keeps nice and tight this side too okay so we have something like this okay this is the stitch hope you enjoy it's really easy as you can see it goes grows up very fast so uh, in uh, in a in the afternoon you you can just work a really really soft and nice and interesting scarf if you want to so hope you enjoy hope i give you some inspiration for a uh, new project crochet project thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe so you won't miss another video of mine on crochet tunisian crochet and knitting uh, if you want to uh, share with me some photos of your projects made uh, with my following uh, one of my tutorials uh, I am always happy uh, to see them. You can just um, send me a photo uh, in a message, private message on my Facebook page or you can just tag me on Instagram and I would be so very happy to leave you a nice comment or my opinion on your project. Uh, you just uh, leave me so many beautiful comments so I just want to leave you back of course so thank you and thank you all that you already sent me so very beautiful uh, photos of your projects see you at the next tutorial bye bye